Hey, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how to get the walk on driver fully recognized without having to put the system to sleep. Um, as far as I can tell, this isn't compatible with the touch base. Um, I haven't really had a lot of time to experiment with it, so if you guys want to, I'm just gonna show you real quick what I did to get it working. Um, so go ahead and install the driver before last for the Wacom, the 5.3.2.2 version. And then open up the newest version, 5.3.3.3. And right click it, go to show package contents, contents, and then double click archive.pax.gz. This will make an archive folder in your downloads folder. Open that up. You go to library, launch agents, and then you're going to take this file and replace the one that was installed with the previous driver, but that's the only component you need. So uh, open your root hard drive, go to the same location, <coughs> library, launch agents, and then you're going to replace the old one with this one. Authenticate, replace. And I'm gonna, I'll go ahead and restart a couple times just to show you guys. This is a vanilla install, completely bare, uh, no text, no DSDT, so it's probably a little bit slow. I'm just really doing this to show you guys how to go about getting the pen to work without putting it to sleep. might take a few seconds to load up everything uh, see there you go I'm going to press pane and it's all ready I'll um I'll include the launch agent file in a zip with some text that I'm currently using. Um, just go ahead and install the previous version of the Wacom driver and throw that launch agent into your root of your OS 10 install library and launch agents. Alright, let me know how it works for you guys. Good luck.